Hey guys! So, happy Friday. I recently went to Bath and Body Works, um, and I got a few things. So I thought I would do a haul for you guys, so you guys can kind of see what I'm into this summer from Bath and Body Works and what kind of I've been looking for and what I've been getting recently from them. So first things first, I got a whole bunch of um, wallflower air freshener scents to go into my wallflower. I got quite a few scents and the first one is uh, uh, Sweet Pea and Sweet Pea is one of my all-time favorite scents from Bath and Body Works. It's just so amazing. The next scent that I got is Mahogany Teakwood and this one it's kind of different. It kind of reminds me of like the smell that like that a lot of boys have when they wear like cologne and things like that. The third scent that I got is funny because it's White Barn number three, <laughs> Renew and Refresh. This one just makes my entire room smell so good. It makes me really calm and kind of relaxed and it just really smells great to me. Next one that I got is Caribbean Escape. And I really love this scent. I have it in a candle as well, and I've pretty much burnt the candle down to nothing. And it just smells wonderful. It reminds me of being in like a tropical place with like the smells of all the drinks mixing together and just like the air in general. It makes me really happy. The next one that I got is First Bloom. And this one, I'm not really a huge fan of like floral scents because I find them to be very overpowering a lot of the time. But this one, I found to be quite light and very refreshing. It's not super heavy, it doesn't have a huge like intense flower scent, but this one I found that it just is perfect. And my room is really small as well, so this one fills it up really quickly, but it makes it smell good and it's not an overpowering scent of flowers and it just smells good. The next one that I got, I got it just by itself one day and this, I've used it up quite a lot and I've also accidentally spilt it a couple of times, so it's, quite, it's almost empty which makes me kind of sad, but it is the scent Tiki Beach, and it is probably, well, I guess now it's my second favorite scent from Bath & Body Works because they have London Calling now, and London Calling is like my favorite thing in the entire world. Okay, but this one just smells like the candle, and it just smells so amazing, and I'm obsessed with it, so I've burnt this one pretty much out. There's like nothing left in the jar. And the last wallflower that I got um, is London Calling, which is my new favorite scent from Bath & Body Works ever. It just smells so good. And if anyone knows me, they know that I am obsessed with British things and just London in general. Moving on, I got uh, four of the little car air freshener pouches, I guess, for the air freshener that I have, but I don't actually have a car yet, so it's kind of weird that I have these, but I don't have a car, but that's okay. The scents that I got this time are Tiki Beach. Um, I think that's pretty much self-explanatory for me, Tiki Beach. The next one that I got is Island Margarita, and it smells really good to me, actually. I don't know what a margarita is supposed to smell like, so I think it smells like one, but I really don't know for sure, but I just like how it smells, and I thought it was a suitable scent to have with my Anchor, um air freshener holder, so why not? The next one that I got, keeping with this beach theme apparently, is um, Peach Bellini? Bellini. Peach Bellini. And it, again, I'm not sure what a Bellini is supposed to smell like, but I think this one smells amazing. And the last um, air freshener scent that I got is uh, Clean Mist, and it just smells clean. <laughs> That's a really bad way to put it, but it does. It smells like just like clean air, fresh air, and I just like it a lot. The last two things that I got are both candles, and the first one is Boathouse Row or Row or something like that. Row or Row, it's one of the two of them. And unfortunately in Canada we don't get a scent description at the bottom of our candles. I don't know why, but we just get like um, a bunch of different warnings about them in English. French, um, Spanish, maybe? And Arabic, I want to say. It smells really good. It kind of reminds me of kind of like being by a beach or by the ocean. It kind of has like a scent of almost like ocean spray in it. And the last thing that I got, again, it's a candle. It is my all-time favorite purchase in the entire world from Bath & Body Works, and it is the London Calling Candle. And 
as I said, everyone who knows me knows that I'm obsessed with London and British things. And this one, I've already started burning it. Burned it last night. Oops. Um, it just smells so, so good. And I just can't get over it. It just smells like tea and lemon and it's just perfect. It's so pretty and it's so simple and white, the candle. And then the top of it has a cool design on the top of it, on top of the lid. And I just think this is the most perfect thing I could have ever bought in my entire life from Bath & Body Works. So that's it for today's video, I guess. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I enjoyed filming it. That's really cheesy to say, but I like, I like hauls. I like watching them and I like filming them, apparently. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed the video today because it really helps me out a lot and it means the world to me when you guys do that. So if you want to make me really happy, you can subscribe to my channel and give my video a thumbs up. Uh, yay! And until I see you guys next, I hope you're having a wonderful day. Goodbye!